Hello and welcome to the section 2 of the course Python Components. Now in this section we are going to take a look at various points. First of all we will learn about variable and string, then list and dictionary, function and iteration and finally networking and file input output. So let's start with the first video of section 2, Python variable and strings. Now in this video we are going to take a look at couple of points python variables and strings and the examples so now what you need to do here that uh, you need to open pycharm and uh, inside that you need to open a project and then i'm going to show you examples of variables and strings in python so guys uh, you can see here that i've started pycharm inside my windows 10 operating system and we have successfully installed it in the previous section now it's time to use it for running python programs and we are learning about variables and strings here so i will provide you examples here that how to create python programs now you can see here that we have started a new project untitled 2 now to open a file inside it you can simply right click here click new click file you can type the file name for example the file name is demo.py click ok and here it is so demo.py has started inside the python ide right now let's talk about variable first so how we can type a variable inside python how we can add the variables how we can subtract variables how we can demonstrate a variable inside it that I'm going to show you here. So a basic example of variable is for example, let's take value inside it. So for example, a is the variable name and a equal to 5. Right? Second variable is b equal to 6. Alright? And c equal to a plus b. So I have taken a variable a and uh, I've inserted a value of 5 inside it then another variable b and 6 is the value inside it and now another val variable c c means a new variable which is a plus b right now if you want to print the addition of a and b you can type here print bracket open and close and then the variable name c so first variable second variable third variable and now i'm printing the final so i can type here like uh, the addition of a and b is right so the sentence will appear in the result that the addition of a and b is and then c c means the value of c the value of c is a plus b which is 6 plus 5 11 right so you can simply click run here right you can click run after that select the project so or the file so this is the file demo click here and uh, here you can see that in the result the addition of a and b is 11 you can see the result here of this program right now if i want to perform subtraction so i can try here b minus a right and uh, again if i run here run demo and here it is basically you can change it to subtraction i can try a sub sub of a and b is now again i can run here it is so the sub of a and b is one 6 minus 5 equal to 1 right so that's how you can write a variable inside python you can provide a value inside it how you can add subtract and any other process you want you can provide here and then this is the way how you can print the string basic string and the variable inside it right and this is the result of this program so this is a basic information about python number now let's learn about string that how you can define a string and uh, various processes so let me remove this right 
so let's take a string here for example you can define string with str and in single code you can type the string for example string is hello world right this is the string i'm taking here so what we can do here how we can print it so to print the string you can type here print and in inside print you can type str and that's how you can print the string you can run this program so click run click run demo and uh, here you can see that this is the result hello world i have printed the string the string was hello world now for example if i want to print a part of that string for example the first character of the string is h so how i can print only first character so what you can do here you can type here print inside str and inside in capital brackets you can type zero so it will start with zero and end with minus one so h is zero then e is one l is two like this right so str zero means the first character of the string so the first character is h so it will print h right here you can check here click run click run demo and here it is so you can see here that it has print h in the result right now how you can print a range here so to print a range here you can type here print inside str you can type for example uh, 3 to 5 i want to print so 3 colon 5 got it now you can again click run click run demo and here it is so lo is printed here so 3 to 5 is lo 0 1 2 3 4 5 so it will skip 5 it means 3 to 4 only so 3 to 4 is lo that's why it is printed lo for example if i make it 4 to 5 and if i again run it so it will only print a single character o right so 0 1 2 3 4 fourth one is o and it will skip the fifth one that's why got it now if you want to print the characters after a particular character for example i can try pair string to colon so what will happen it will print the other characters here so i can click run click run demo and here you can see so 0 1 2 right so it will start from number 2 and it will end till d so you can see the word here l l o w o r l d right what if you want to repeat this string how we can repeat it to repeat it you can type here print after that str multiply by 2 so it will print a double string here click run click run demo and here you can see that hello world hello world is printed twice by using 2 if you make it 3 it will print thrice so final is for example if you want to add a string right how you can add two strings here so to add two strings you can type here print for example the string plus for example if i want to make add something else for example uh, wow so str plus wow so it will look like hello world wow so you can click run click run demo and here you can see the result hello world wow so that's how you can add two strings inside python so these all are the results and uh, these all are the operations with strings so this is the basics of uh, python variables and strings